Hello folks, I just woke up, I barely sipped my coffee, I went to sign on Facebook, and this is what I see. What the fresh hell is this? <laughs> okay, somehow this goes against their community standards. Now, I don't think they understand this at all, I think they just... Well, I don't get it, but uh, I don't like this guy, he has so many violations, it seems like he's doing something bad again. By the way folks, you may get away with a lot of things on Facebook, but once you start getting in trouble, then you get in trouble for almost anything. And so you get stuff like this. Well, anyway, let's, let's see what's going on here. Yes, I know, it goes against your community st Okay, I guess we gotta click it twice, okay, whatever. <laughs> and you're temporarily blocked from posting for another 30 days. Yeah. By the way, a couple of days ago, I was blocked from being able to post anything or comment anything in any discussion groups. And this is funny, folks. They do this new thing. You are suspended or blocked from doing anything, but they allow you to log in and look. It's really weird. It's like being in jail and being able to look at everybody and hear everyone, but you can't interact with them. It's kind of like you've been, well, ghosted. So you can see when I go to post, this pops up. 29 days, huh? Okay, well, uh, how did it go from how did it go from 30 to 29? I don't know. Oh, okay, look, you can actually say this is a mistake. Not that this ever works, but I clicked it's a mistake and they say, thanks for letting us know. We'll review your activity from your account against our community standards. Uh-huh, yeah, will a real human do it in some other country who doesn't understand a goddamn thing? Or will one of your American employees do it? By the way, your American employees are probably sympathetic to Antifa. Apparently this is a cultural thing for Silicon Valley because as we saw in a recent Saragon of Akkad video, Twitter knowingly, knowingly and openly employs a open Antifa supporter. Okay, and Jack of Twitter, the guy who runs Twitter, the CEO of Twitter, he actually follows his Antifa employee who tweets pro-Antifa propaganda, okay? So fuck you, you tech giants. You are disgusting vermin. You're terrorist supporters. We all know that you can have a terrorist Facebook or a terrorist Twitter. In an upcoming video, I'll even prove it to you. You could just, you could say the most racist, disgusting, hateful stuff as long as you identify as a Muslim. At the very most, you'll get a slap on the wrist, and then if you just say, hey, you're being Islamophobic, I want you to review this post, they'll let you back on. I'll prove that in a future video. Oh, and by the way, if you want, you could scroll down and see the link to this Sargon of Akkad video. Hashtag verified hate suspended from Twitter. It's, you know, it starts off discussing how, you know, Jack from, you know, the CEO from Twitter does knowingly follow one of his, so one of his employees who is an Antifa supporter who tweets out pro Antifa stuff, right? So fuck you tech giants and fuck every one of you scumbags who are defending these tech giants saying, oh, well, you know, they have the right to, yes, they have the right but it is not right, you fucking assholes. And by the way, I'm not sure if they do have the legal right because, you know, these people are monopolizing communication. So at some point we have to demonopolize these people, okay? It's either, look, are they a publisher? In which case they have editorial responsibilities and therefore control? Or are they a platform in which case they shouldn't have the ability to censor us? Because if they're just a platform or if they're just a publisher, you know, either way, they shouldn't be a monopoly. So anyway, fuck Facebook and fuck Twitter and snuck and fuck not and snuck fap chat. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> I like it. It's cute and horrible. All the same time. <laughs> Like I said, I didn't have my coffee yet. But anyway, yeah, there you go. I'm suspended for either 30 days or 29 days or whatever the fuck. Fuck you, Facebook. Fuck you, Twitter. Snapchat, etc. He's even more adorable without his coffee in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> this I, is a fact. I just wander around mumbling like a grumpy. Which is goddamn adorable. <laughs> You're like a grumpy bear that's sleepy crusty in your eyes. It's fucking awesome. I'm glad that you find that adorable and that's just... Another reason why I'm such a lucky man to have a woman like you. I love you. <laughs> Sorry, folks. Are you throwing up yet? <laughs> <laughs> well, folks, let's see what happens if I uh, write them a note or give them feedback or whatever they call this here. Let's see about your post. Bullshit, 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 bullshit.
bullshit, 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 bullshit. Is that all I'm ever gonna get from you guys? And if you think your photo shouldn't have been removed, you can reply to this message with more information and we'll review your photo again. If it doesn't go against our community standards, we'll restore it to Facebook. How was this experience? Frowny face. By the way, you could see this. I mentioned this earlier. It says you're temporarily restricted from joining and posting to groups that you do not manage until tomorrow at 7.26 p.m. And now that is extended 29 more days, you see, because the new uh, violation means I can't do anything other than read. This photo goes against our community standards on hate speech. Let's open. We have a choice of accept decision. <laughs> yeah, right. Or send feedback. Let's send feedback. Let's ruin somebody's morning. <laughs> Let's trigger some Facebook employee. Because you know people employed at Facebook, they're all fragile little snowflakes in a bubble. Tell us more. What can I write here? All right. You have no clue what you are doing. Your double standards are glaringly obvious. Your hypocrisy is epic. We free-thinking people take solace and satisfaction in the fact that you are shooting yourselves in the foot, constructing your own demise. Good riddance. You deserve to fail, and you will. And send. Okay, let's try that again. Send. <coughs> wow. And frowny face. And, oh yeah, this is past stuff. <laughs> These are all... These are all decisions and, you know, community standard violation stuff and blah, 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 blah. All right, everyone. Tell me what you think of this. Leave me a comment below. And peace, love, freedom, and equality. And fuck Facebook, fuck Twitter, Snapchat, etc. Hey, listen, before it's too late, subscribe to us on BitChute. It's like YouTube, but they don't censor. In fact, you can see some of our best videos on BitChute only because YouTube removes them. Also, YouTube gives us strikes on content they deem to be not okay, even though they're really vague about what's okay and what's not okay. Right now, we have two strikes on our channel. It takes 60 days for a strike to go away. A third strike means our channel's deleted, so we're just one strike away from our channel being deleted, so subscribe to us on BitChute. See that link below. Also, see the link below to my mines and my camp. If you friend or follow me, I'll do the same to you. Thanks for watching, everyone.